The first Spider-Man game had 28 suits at launch, and more have been added throughout the years, like recently when they added the hybrid suit and the inside-out upgraded suit from Spider-Man No Way Home. But here is a list of suits that they forgot to add and can do so in the upcoming Spider-Man 2 game. Number one is the classic suit in Spider-Man No Way Home. MCU Spider-Man has a new suit and I'm sure we will all love to see it in the game. However, this does look very similar to the classic suit in the first game, so this could be a nice replacement for that when entering the second game. The second suit that should be added is the symbiote suit. Everyone has been wanting this for a long time and now since one of the main villains or allies in the new game is Venom, we can finally expect to see a symbiote suit in the game. But why stop there when you can be so much more? We now have the perfect opportunity to bring in the symbiote suit from Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man 3, which I am sure everyone will love to see alongside the original Sam Raimi suit. Next up is the Amazing Spider-Man 2 suit. We had the suit from the Amazing Spider-Man 1, but we still don't have the suit from the second movie. And especially since this is a really loved suit throughout the whole Spider-Man fanbase, why isn't this in the game yet? It would be the perfect addition to the second game, and the naming works too. The Amazing Spider-Man 2 suit in the Spider-Man 2 game. The fourth suit that is missing is the wrestler suit. No, 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 not, not that one. This one. Yes, this is a suit that will make so many people happy and also will be pretty nice to have in the game. Now for the last suit, or should I say last two suits, it's obvious Miles Morales is going to be a big part of this game too, so he will also need some new suits, right? Well, the first suit is the updated suit that we can see in Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, but since the movie is nowhere near release yet, we can understand that. But what isn't acceptable is the fact that we didn't get this into the Spider-Verse suit with the jacket. Miles' sportswear suit is, in my opinion, one of the best suits in the game. Just the simplicity of the mask and the jacket is something that makes it look really nice. And so, using the same logic as most of the other suits, can Insomniac please just stick this hoodie, turquoise jacket, and these shorts and shoes on the Spider-Verse suit because having this suit will be genuinely so cool. If you liked my list of the suits that should be in Spider-Man 2, then give the video a like. And if you want more videos like this one, then you should consider subscribing to the channel and also checking out this video because I will show you everything you missed in the Spider-Man 2 trailer. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.